Hey, how's it going? It's Sam Frost here from Easy PPC Tutorials. In today's video, I'm going to show you really quickly uh, how you can actually go and duplicate an ad group or even duplicate a campaign within Google Ads. Uh, a lot of people uh, you know, who are starting out on the platform aren't aware that there are some easy shortcuts to make things faster. So I'm just gonna show you really quickly how you can do this. So what I'm gonna do is, is, is give you a, a scenario as to where I would quite often be duplicating an ad group uh, and then I'll, I'll show you how you, you go through the process. So in my dummy account, I'm gonna go to all the campaigns I've got and I'm gonna find a just a old display campaign. It, it doesn't matter that this campaign's not actually doing anything. I'll just set the data range to all time. Uh, this is purely a testing account. So what we're looking at here, uh, we're gonna pick this campaign, custom intent branding. Uh, so this is just a display campaign I ran to test a few different things. And what we can see here is that we've got an ad group set up called custom intent. Now this ad group is called custom intent because it targets uh, a custom intent audience that I set up. Uh, now I'm not gonna go into what a custom intent audience is in this video, but what I'm gonna show you how to do is actually duplicate this ad group. So the reason you might duplicate an ad group is because you want to really quickly uh, spin off another ad group that you can then change the targeting options on. So you might want to see how does custom intent uh, compare to say a similar audience or a keyword targeted audience or, or anything like that. So all you have to do uh, is really, really simple. You just check the box here, you hit edit and copy, or you can use the, the command copy or control copy if you're using Windows. And then all you do is you actually paste your new campaign. And you'll see this option here, or you paste your new ad group, I should say. And you've got the option to pause your new ad groups after pasting. Um, the reason you might select this is just simply so that if you forget to go and change the targeting, you're not double targeting, um, you know, you've not got two ad groups running that are exactly the same, but we're gonna go straight in anyway and um, actually sort of fix this up. So it's pasting the ad groups, you can see it running the process here. Now it's done and boom, we can see we've now got a secondary ad group. It's whatever that ad group name was with a number two after it, we can change this. We're gonna call this keyword targeted. And then what we can do is we can actually go in and look at the, uh, at the settings, at the, at, the, at the targeting options that are in here. And we can go through and we can actually start uh, changing things. So we can see here that this uh, ad group originally that it was copied from had this audience applied, but I'm gonna remove this audience. Obviously I don't want the same audience being in a uh, duplicate ad group. And then what we can do once that's removed is we could go in here and we could do keyword targeting for this ad group instead. So we're gonna add some display keywords, marketing, uh, advertising, uh, SEO, PPC, all those kind of things. It doesn't, it's just an example. It doesn't really matter too much. Uh, and we're gonna hit save and you can see that's saved here and boom, there you go. Now the campaign's obviously paused, this won't start delivering, but that is how easy it is to uh, duplicate an ad group. So remember you can duplicate ad groups for whatever reason you want. Uh, just make sure that if you're duplicating an ad group, you actually go in and do something with a duplicated one, uh, changing the targeting, changing you know settings, whatever you want to do, different ad copies, although generally I do that within the same ad group anyway. Uh, but yeah, it's, it's really easy to do. The same process applies for duplicating campaigns as well. You just check the box from the campaign menu. So you can see here, we can duplicate this campaign. I can copy it and I can paste it. And once it's done, uh, we can obviously have the same options with the addition of choosing the start and end dates and I'd hit paste and boom, I'd have a duplicate of that campaign. So if you have campaigns that sort of perhaps roll out on a periodic basis and you've got a template you want to use, well, that would be how you would do that option. So yeah, hopefully you find that useful. Um, you know, a few people I've spoken to who manage their own Google ads who are starting out didn't realize you can copy and paste. Uh, they, they, they think that you have to create everything manually again but certainly where I find it really helpful is in display campaigns, video ad campaigns, where you're gonna have multiple uh, targeting options often within one ad group, uh, sorry, within one campaign. So you might have three or four different ad groups per campaign. You want the ads to be the same, but you want to quickly change the targeting options. So I hope you find that useful. Uh, please like and subscribe for more easy PPC tutorials. And if you need any help, drop a comment. Otherwise I'll see you on the next video.